Sir, I have myself full confidence that if all do their duty, if nothing is neglected, and if the best arrangements are made, as they are being made, we shall prove ourselves once more able to defend our island home, to ride out the storm of war, and to outlive the menace of tyranny, if necessary for years, if necessary alone. At any rate, that is what we are going to try to do. That is the resolve of His Majesty's government, every man of them. That is the will of Parliament and the nation, the British Empire and the French Republic, linked together in their cause and in their need, will defend to the death their native soil, aiding each other like good comrades to the utmost of their strength. We shall go on to the end. We shall fight in France. We shall fight on the seas and oceans. We shall fight with growing confidence and growing strength in the air. We shall defend our island, whatever the cost may be. We shall fight on the beaches. We shall fight on the landing grounds. We shall fight in the fields and in the streets. We shall fight in the hills. We shall never surrender. And if, which I do not for a moment believe, this island or a large part of it was subjugated and starving, then our empire beyond the seas, armed and guarded by the British fleet, would carry on the struggle until in God's good time, the new world with all its power and might steps forth to the rescue and the liberation of the old. Well, hello everybody and welcome back to the Hilltop Pillbox here in Abbotsford, British Columbia, Canada. And uh, here we are on turn six of season five of the BBR YouTube Wars. And uh, as we all know, if you've been playing along, uh, the Axis have absolutely been destroying. From the very first dice roll on, uh, they have not looked back. Uh, speaking with my allies, we haven't even be able. We haven't been able to make the Axis worry about anything. We have not. Uh, we have not done a good job, and they have done an excellent job. And uh, yeah, so they're up around 15, 16, 17 points right now. I'm not exactly sure how many they have. They had 15 at the end of last round. They only need 12. So there's not much chance that we're going to be uh, coming out victorious here. But we're gonna. We're going to try to uh, to mess things up as best as we can. Alrighty. So, for uh, this uh, move here, we've got... Uh, oh, here's my bill. So, I've got 41 bucks because I had a really nice roll for the convoy. Uh, although, I'll be getting more convoy this round, I'm sure. Uh, so, i got 41. So, i got 30 I'm going to spend on three fighters. And then, I've got 11... I'm going to spend on two artillery and a man. So I'm not saving anything there. Uh, it's all going on the board, and then the convoy will shred me for my turn seven purchase, I am sure. But we'll be in a fairly defensive posture at that point, I am sure. So as long as I've got 18 bucks left to buy six men, I think I'll be happy. All right, so here we go. We're going to send over this whole fleet. we got a battleship, a cruiser, a carrier, and a destroyer. Just missing the sub. To have the uh, the full meal deal there. Two transports are coming over. They'll be bringing along these two tanks. Okay, they're going to come along. And I know it's non-com, really. They're going to drop off in Ceylon. Uh, talk to Moffat Field. He has a fighter here for scrambling, but he's not going to scramble against all that noise. So the Japanese transport has died a uh, horrible death. Um, over here, we have got... Oh, and these two fighters are coming as well. There. That was part of the deal. Okay, little little fleet there. All right, this tactical is going to be making a run at that tank in eastern Iran. So you got to wish me luck on this one because it's uh, it's one of these I got to get the got to get the die roll right off the bat here. So, uh, oh, all of my dice are up in upstairs because I'm filming some other stuff right now. Okay, well we'll just use this. All right, so I need a three. I need a three as a target select on the tank. If I get it, there's no battle. 
hey, I got a three, and a three or less, of course, but the actual three works, so that Japanese tank is gone. Of course, they retain the territory, uh, but that's, uh, yeah, that's all done with. He's got two left, because again, I have uh, ATC, so one, two, three, four, he's got two left, five, six, he's going to land there in Iraq. All right, well, that's, that's it. Hey, Easy, easy turn. We're just going to do some non-com now. Um, we have got one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see here. Yeah, I think. Yeah, we're going to have one tank go up to Iraq. Just one, mind you. And everything else is just going to be a placement. So we're going to place our three fighters in Cairo. And we'll be placing the two artillery and the infantry in Iraq. Okay. Uh, so I spent all my money. I didn't go up any here. Oh, that one was there in case the fighters had to actually engage in combat. But they didn't because there was no scramble. Uh, so for my money, <laughs> which is getting... <laughs> rather provincial at this time uh if let's see here so we're down we start 38 we lose three seven for 31 another three down to 28 27 26 uh minus five is 21 and then we've got these two put me back up to 25 uh but then we lost malta which is worth one in this game so 24 all right so i'm down to 24 but then I have Ethiopia for 25. All right. Now, is that correct? I just got to... I believe it is. I believe I have 25. I don't think there's anything else that has a... All this is Dutch. And if you ain't Dutch, you ain't much. Am I right? Okay. So, that is everything. So, I'm losing 3, 7, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, down to 21... Uh, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 25. I think that's right. All right. Um, now I get convoyed, which is not right. It's wrong. It's evil. It's hideous, hideous subs. Okay, so we got two subs up here. So they auto get two, and then they roll four dice total, and we add anything up until eight. Okay, well, they're getting more. So they got two, four, and then two for each sub is $6 I'm going to be losing from there. But there's also a sub convoying here. So there's a total of two, three that they can convoy from me and one from Syria. But, of course, France doesn't have a thing. So, and one, two, three. Yeah, so I lost three there. I lost six there. So I'm down nine bucks. Nine bucks. I knew that was going to happen, though. All right. We got fortunate last round. We got fortunate last round, but not this round. Okay. So I'm losing nine bucks. I'm at 25 minus nine. Takes me down to 16. Will I have enough? Yes, I will, because I still control these. So I get five for that. That takes me up to 21. And then I control two of these, which puts me back up to 25. So the convoy essentially took care of those two. All right, so 25 bucks for the UK to spend next round. And uh, that's plenty for my plans, which is to hunker in the bunker, as they say. Kind of a Detroit thing. And uh, yeah, there you go. I will now do the flyby that I absolutely neglected last time. So apologies to anyone who uh, cared. One, two, three, four, five, six men. And one mech in uh, London, along with a bunch of other stuff, and five triple A's. And with the Germans building a couple of transports there, who knows? They might take a G8 shot at London. Uh, over here in Cairo, we have got four fighters and two tacticals. We've got four tanks and one British infantry, one Canadian infantry, and two free French. In Iraq, we have one tank, two artillery, one infantry, and one tactical. And in C-Zone 39, 
we have two transports, a destroyer, a cruiser, a battleship, a carrier with two fighters, and on Ceylon, we have two tanks. All right, and that is it. That's all we got. So that is Britain's turn, and now I'm going to uh, hand it over to Italy. Uh, Hambone here, who is pressing hard with the Italians and uh, basically having his way. As much trouble as they may have had taking Gibraltar, it took them an extra turn. Uh, they have basically had no natural enemies this this uh, this game. Britain has been hemmed in here in Cairo. They've done a good job. They have all of this for a point. Whoops, sorry, Canadian. They have all of this for a point. They've got all this for a point. They've got all this for a point. They got their three ports for a point. They're doing well. And, uh, yeah, not much we can really do except ride this one out, see if we can learn a few tips and tricks, and uh, and uh, just help the BBR become that... Uh, the, the best game on the planet when it comes to Axis and Allies. And uh, hopefully everybody's enjoying. All right, folks, thanks for watching. Take care, and as we say all the time, hug your loved ones, and may those dice be with you. Especially when the Italians come to get you. Ooh, look at that. Evil. <laughs>